Is spanning tree important in Ethernet networks? Why is it important? What happens when you disable spanning tree? Are you crazy? So to help answer those questions, I've got a packet tracer network consisting of two PCs, PC1 and PC2, which are connected to layer two switches. These switches are running a default configuration. And as you can see, in Packet Tracer, this interface is blocking. So in other words, Spanning Tree is blocking on this port. We can see that by looking at the CLI of the switch. So Show Spanning Tree shows us that Gigabit 102 has an alternate role in Spanning Tree and the current status is blocking. That means that, for example, pings from PC1 to PC2 will be sent across this link, Gigabit 101, and not across Gigabit 102. BPDUs or Bridge Protocol Data Units and some other management traffic will be sent and received on this port, such as Cisco Discovery Protocol and Link Layer Discovery Protocol or CDP and LLDP, but user traffic will not be received or transmitted on this port. So what happens if you disable spanning tree on both of these switches? What will happen to the network? Now, before I continue, let me warn you, you use this packet tracer lab at your own risk. If you disable spanning tree on switches, as I'm going to do in this video, your PC's CPU could go to 100%, packet tracer could crash, and other nasty things could happen. So if you follow what I'm going to do here, the risk is entirely yours. So what do you think is going to happen when we disable spanning tree on both of these switches? How will traffic flow? So as an example, if PC1 sends a ping to PC2, how will packets traverse the network? What will happen? To help demonstrate that, you can use simulation mode in Packet Tracer. And for this example, I'm only going to look at ARP and ICMP traffic. If you want to try this yourself, download the Packet Tracer file and use simulation mode in Packet Tracer. But again, doing what I'm going to do here is done at your own risk. I'm now going to demonstrate what happens when spanning tree is disabled on both of these switches and show you how packets flow in the network.